George Dreswell here, and I am here to do another film review. And this time I'm doing a film review of a movie called Prime Gate by Malachi Beisel. This guy's got some cool movies. I'm just going to let you know you're going to want to watch this. You know, it's just. Oh, it's just incredible. You know, it's just so cool. So cool. Um, I mean, you feel like you're on the edge of your seat and you, you're there. And you're like, okay. I'm through the gate, you know. But anyway, um, I just want to say uh, it begins with, uh, you know, talking about Prime Gate began as, uh, you know, like two dudes garage and a plant. I don't know where this freaking plant comes in, but I know what's in there, man. I know what's in there. Um, you know, I, I don't really don't want to give this movie away. I want you to watch it yourself. Um, it's kind of like a sci like a dark sci-fi movie. It's a really cool music. Um, and you'll like these characters because it's just so different, you know. Um, and I know Nara's up to something because he's got this other plan. It's going to bring other people through this gate. Or is she going to put more people through there? I don't know. It's like a gateway to hell or something, a gateway to the future. But the future is the past, and we don't know what this gate is. And somehow there's this box. But there's a screw in a jar, and it's in a box. But she seals this box up, you know. And it's that look, that look, man, when, when Marion was like, <laughs> not, he wasn't stuck in the, the gate. You know, Gildar was like through there, and Marion was stuck out, and thinking she's gone, and then it's like, I don't know, it's like my life flashed before me, and there was Nara's face, just, <laughs> you know, I was like, oh crap, something just hit the fan, it's not pretty. <laughs> I knew something was going to happen. You know, the next thing, you know, you got... Marin's stuck inside the gate. Um, oh man, I just I, I so just want to tell you everything about the movie. It's just so dang cool. But you just gotta watch it. You know, you gotta find out what this prime gate is. Find out what this box is, and why we make tea when we're in trouble. And you know, and who steals a man's shoes? Gildar got his shoes stolen. You'll just have to find out. Um, it's just such a cool movie. It's such a cool movie. Um, I just recommend it to your families, friends, your pets, dogs, brothers, sisters, aunts, girlfriends, cousins, goats, brother. I don't know, but just tell them all. Just tell everybody about it. You know, just you got to see this, man. You know, you got to always keep coming with more movies and better stuff and better stuff and better stuff. You know, this is like. It's way up here. I, I'd raise my hand higher, but it goes out of the screen of my phone, so that's the best I could do. Um, I just highly recommend it. You know, it's just really cool. It's just really cool. I feel like I look like a educated Gene Simmons right now or something. I don't know. Not too good here. Uh, but anyway, uh, this is my, that's my film review for Prime Gate by Malachi Beisel. This director's got it going on, man. He's got it going on. He's got to check it out. You know, get everybody to watch it. And, you know, definitely watch the bloopers. You're going to want to watch the bloopers. It just makes it so much, so much better. And you're going to, you can listen to the soundtrack, too. You know, this soundtrack is just, yeah. It makes my head shake just thinking about it. But that's good because those nuts rattle around. And it gets me concentrating, you know. I'm just like, wow, I feel so creative right now. <laughs> you know, but, you know, all that together is just, uh, I just so want to tell you so much more, but, you know, you got to be here, you got to be there, you can, you could do anything, you just have to watch Prime Gate, and watch the bloopers, and listen to the soundtrack, then your life will change, you know, you open your eyes to a new beginning, and that new beginning is called Prime Gate. And that was created by Malachi Beisel. Just remember that. Remember that. Because there's always more. There's always more. And there's always a different future. See you soon. Thanks.